Investigators are working to track down the driver who left a pedestrian in critical condition this morning and fled the scene. It happened here in southwest Philadelphia at 70th Cobb and Cobbs Creek Parkway. Police say the 58 year old victim was crossing the street just before 11 a.m. when she was hit. And just in tonight, we've got new video of the car that police say was involved here. Action News reporter Sharifa Jackson live near the scene now. And Sharifa, you've got more on that car that police would very much like to find tonight. Yeah, Brian is a white Ford Mustang and they just released those images, that video. They're hoping that that leads to some information. Now, as far as the victim, she is described by neighbors and people who live around here as a very well-known panhandler who, again, has been in this area for years. This is video just released by Philadelphia police. It shows a white Ford Mustang with a gray or black convertible top wanted for a hit and run. That's one of the craziest roads and you know even with the speed bumps people still drive crazy. The latest victim on Cobbs Creek Parkway, a 58 year old female believed to be crossing at 70th Street just around 1046 this morning. Police say she was hit by a vehicle that kept going to neighbors. She was a well known panhandler. Yeah, she's a normal um, it's normally like three or four of them. Michael, who works at Crab Daddy's across the street, heard the impact. It sounded like um, like cars colliding, and then we turned around and you know she was laying there. The victim left lying in the intersection, suffering serious injuries. She was rushed to Lincoln Hall Hospital, where she remains in critical condition. Police are looking for that vehicle with a partial Pennsylvania tag of JFE. Not saying like it's not surprising, but it's just like you know on that road, it's just like oh, of course, but. Still always sad. Neighbors say the scene of the accident can be very dangerous and not uncommon for drivers to speed, an ongoing issue for years. In September of 2020, an advocacy group started a petition demanding PennDOT and the city's street department to implement better safety plans for pedestrians and bicyclists along the parkway. In August of 2020, a 25-year-old woman was killed while crossing the street. This is a tough intersection because it goes five different ways. And then the traffic light, not a lot of people see that one right there. So if you don't wait a couple seconds, uh, when the light goes green, it can get tough. Again, the victim in this latest hit and run, she remains in the hospital with some very serious injuries. There's a $5,000 reward for any information leading to an arrest or conviction. We're live in Southwest Philadelphia, Sharifa Jackson, Channel 6 Action News. Brian. Yeah, hopefully someone recognizes that car and can help call police tonight. Sharifa, thank you.